So I put a set in here, got a nice beaver caught on a, on a caster mount set. Um, them sets are really, really deadly in the, in, the, in the spring, and they work all year, you know, except for through the ice in the northern spots, but, uh, you know, the rest of the year they work awesome. And uh, pull this beaver out. Front foot catch, nice catch. Really nice beaver, no bite marks. Couldn't, couldn't be better. I'm just gonna put that one end, push it right back down in there. You wanna make sure you get that end way down deep in the mud uh, so they can't pull it. Slide. Nah, I use a long T bar. Um, I like uh, no less than 24 inches. Any less than that, you're gonna have problems with this end pulling out. You know, it'll jimmy it out. Not every time, but enough where it'll be a pain in your ass. So, you know, 24, best 30 inch, you know, for your rebar going down. I take work this area up, create my gap, get some my, my uh, caster mounts gone, get some more mud and weeds and put up there. Just like so. A lot of times I'll take my axe. Even get that groove a little bit, so you're making a groove up through there for them to key in on. Plus, it's a good visual. It looks like a beaver came up and was sliding around and messing around here. The mud is attractive to every animal that's in, the, in or around the water. Get me a good bed right there. I take my trap and offset it. Can't get it off enough. Move it down a little bit more. Bed that trap nice and solid. Got my big pile beaver lure. About a quarter size on there. Wait for the next one to come on.